You're kidding, right? I mean it. <sighs> you can't drop the breakup bomb like that. <laughs> Being alone's all right, I guess. Yep. Always was until we met. Then we did. And now I know there's something better. Being with you. We've come too far to quit now. It's not your choice. You really want to leave me? I don't want to. I have to. Listen, it's over. Please, just stay away from me. What happened? At least tell me that. If it was something I did, just say it. Okay. Look. Branded by Pulse. I'm a Lassie. No. Enemy of Cocoon. Danger to us all. <laughs> Get it now? You're my enemy. Goodbye. What is your focus? Let's see, have a focus, right? I'll go with you, help you do it. Just let me. No, if you're with me, the sanctum will be with you. No matter what, we've come too far to quit now. I don't know. I don't know my focus. I'm gonna be a monster. Not if I'm here. I'll protect you. We'll figure this out. Do it together, okay? Okay. It's true what they say. Yeah? When we're finished, I'll turn to Crystal. Don't worry. When the sea complete their focus, they're blessed with the gift of eternity. They wouldn't call it eternity if you died. <laughs> You'll see. You and me will always be together. Making a wish? <laughs> Maybe I was. I was hoping that tomorrow I can tell my sister. Hmm. She'll be so mad, knowing I hid it from her. Yeah, don't worry. I'll take the blame for you. You know, you should ask for something bigger. These are wish-granting fireworks, like in the stories. Stories, huh? You see who fulfill their focus. They become crystal and gain eternal life. <sighs> Would help if they gave you some clue about what you're supposed to do. 
We'll figure this thing out. You will never be one of those monsters. So what will I be? A crystal? <laughs> Yesterday at the store, I got us something. I don't know much about jewelry, but I hope you like it. Stand by you. No matter what happens, I'm yours forever. Sarah. My one, my only. Will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> she said yes! <laughs> <laughs> I love these fireworks. They granted my wish. Your wish? Before I asked you to marry me, I wish that you would say yes. Then maybe they'll grant mine too. What's that? To have the courage to tell Lightning that I've become a lassie. Hey, our engagement is way bigger news. Man, I can't wait to see her face. <laughs> She'll be my new sister. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Snow. Serious? Be quiet. <laughs> Best of luck. Right? 
Melissa. So far, so good. They all want to fight. Good for them. People need heroes. Here. You keep your cool, and they will too. You got it? Got it. What's our motto? The army's no match for Nora. That a boy. It's an out and out massacre. Those people won't even live long enough to die on pulse. That was the idea. What? Sanctum logic. They conjured up the courage to eliminate a threat. I mean, why carry the danger all the way to pulse? Why not just stamp it out here? Execution, masquerading as exile. That's all the Purge ever was. <sighs> Relocation to Pulse. How does the government get away with pulling crap like that? And you? You knew this was gonna happen? The Purge was Psycom. Private Sanctum troops, not the Guardian Corps. Psycom? Guardian Corps. Soldiers are soldiers, aren't they? Pulse Foul C and their Lassie are enemies of the state. Tell a soldier to kill an enemy, and you really think it's gonna matter what uniform he's wearing? Might have mattered to that one. Couldn't shoot. Got himself shot instead. How about you? Hmm? Or to say shoot? You pull the trigger? 
Fine. Forget I asked. You all okay? Hey, careful with those. <laughs> Don't worry. No one's moving to Pulse today. We'll clear you a path out of here, so be ready Wait. to... Wait! Let me fight yeah, with you! you can't expect us to just sit here! <laughs> Could help. Yep. Please, let us help! <laughs> Okay, then. Volunteers front and center. Here, take this one. This one, here you go. And one for you. Count go me for in. It. Here's yours. Take care now. Mom? <laughs> Don't worry. Huh? So I just... Hold it steady. Here. Yeah, feels good. Yeah, uh, nice. Can you show me again? Uh, you got That's it. how it works. <sighs> you sure? Yeah. Moms are tough. <laughs> right. It's the last one, boss. All right, last one. Somebody take it. Uh, yeah. Push comes to shove. Keep him safe. First impression of snow. All top. <laughs> All right, lay low and you'll be fine. We'll clear out the area. Going home together! Come on! Everybody up! Right! New recruits! On me! Come on. Nice. Time to go, kiddo. <laughs> Didn't I? Moms are tough. Ugh! <laughs> 
you happy when I smiled, didn't you? But really, I was afraid. I was always afraid. So, how do you figure that post fallacy is different from the Sanctums? Mm. Things being equal, I just as soon keep on. Time to jump. Yeah. I know. Hey, 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 hang on. <laughs> what the? Hey. <laughs> Damn. Well, she can do it. So can we. What about the others? They didn't die. They couldn't have died. Of course not. Hey, get a grip, man! What's wrong with you? Get who home? Huh? Toss me that. Catch. What are you doing? So what are you afraid of, huh? You're supposed to be the hero. <laughs> 
She's waiting there, ain't she? Your lovely bride-to-be? Isn't it about time you picked her up? Yeah. There's our ride. <laughs> now you're talking. Ah, I think the door is winning. Why didn't I listen? Uh, beg your pardon? It was me. This is my fault. Beg your pardon? Cover your ears. Huh? Oh, oh, last charge? Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, hold, hold on. All right, go for it! Make it happen! I'm so sorry. Please let me in. Please? He is here, calling himself a hero. He's coming our way. Well, what should I do? Tell him what you need to. But nothing I say will change what happened. We could just... run away. Uh, uh. What's gotten into you, soldier? Thought you came for a fight. My sister. Your sister? She's a lassie. What? A pulse lassie? The Falci has her captive. But I'll find her. Uh, is she still... What was her focus? When she became a lassie, what did the Falci order her to do? Uh, it wasn't blow up Cocoon or anything like that, was it? I didn't ask. <gasps> Listen to me. When a person gets cursed by a Falci, they become a lassie. And they get given a focus, right? How do I put this? If they don't carry it out, Lucy we'll end up as one of those things. What I'm saying is, if your sister's gone that far, I mean, she might still. How, how can I? There's no way to turn a Lassie back into a human. Even if she completes her focus, there's no changing her fate. She'll live her life as a foul sea slave. <sighs> Don't make her suffer. Just say it! Any Lassie! Anyone who might ever become a Lassie should be wiped off the face of Cocoon. It's people like you that started the Purge in the first place. How did you get in here? You gotta leave. <sighs> okay, listen. Find some place to hide and keep quiet. Once I find Sarah, we'll all leave together. Uh, 
<laughs> You'll be home in time for dinner. <laughs> you... Wait! Who's Sarah? My wife. Future wife, that is. She's a pulse, Lissy. No. She's here somewhere, along with that foul sea. I gotta find her and set her free. What's wrong with you? Why do you want to help with a sea? They're the enemy. Huh? How can you save a sea? You're not. You're not. That's insane. <laughs> Probably. But I gotta do something, right? I'll be back. Uh, should we wait around for him and hitch a ride? I'd rather go to Pulse! Why is this happening to me? When they found the foul sea the other day, we were just visiting Bodum. Mm. But the army took us, threw us on that train. And because of that guy, Mom is... Probably shouldn't leave them alone. And he wants to help us, see? Hey again. Hey. Let's go with him. You gotta talk to him, Hope. If you don't take this chance, you regret it forever. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Before the army. What? That's a Pulse brand. That girl's a Lassie. I already told you that. Pulse Lassie are the enemies of Cocoon. So they should die? Listen, if she fails her focus, you know how that'll end. And killing her is a mercy? You came. Sarah! Sarah. Is that my hero? Let's get you out of here. Hands off. I'm taking her home. Sis. I'm, I'm not your sister. You couldn't protect her. It's your fault she can save us. Sarah? Save us. Or protect us all. Save Cocoon. Save Cocoon? Sarah, that was your focus? Anything. I'll do anything. Leave it to me. You'll see. I'll protect Cocoon. I'll save everyone. Somehow. I'll make things right. You just relax. Legend. Remember the legend. 
Lissi, who fulfilled their focus, turn to Crystal and gain eternal life. It's the same with Sarah. Eternal life. She's not dead! Sarah's my bride-to-be. I promise to be hers forever. I don't care how many years I have to wait. It's over! Open your eyes and face reality! Sarah? Does becoming a Lassie really mean losing everything? This is goodbye. Lightning! Huh? You're just gonna leave her? Psycom will be here soon. If they find us, we're all dead. You think Sarah'd want that? You think you know how she feels? If I leave her, then I'll never know. We'll be fine. I can handle anything they throw at us. No one will die. I'll protect Sarah. And Cocoon. Does she look protected to you? I can save her! What can you possibly do? Whatever it takes! Oh, me. You two are hopeless. You just can't admit it. You want to stay as much as he does. You're leaving? We want to help Sarah, too. Uh, but without tools, we could be digging for days. The army's on our trail. So for now, we gotta keep moving. For now. So I just abandoned her and saved myself? What about your focus? <gasps> what happened to banding together and saving the world? Isn't that what you promised? Now you want to forget it all and die right here? <sighs> Snow, you're nothing but talk. Lightning! I'll do whatever it takes. I'll finish this focus and keep Sarah safe. That's my promise. Great job so far. <sighs> Stay out of trouble. Mm-hmm. You too. Mm. Get going. But... Later. Okay. Snow. Save it for next time, kiddo. The good left behind. But... It's okay, Hope. Light will take care of you. We'll meet again. <laughs> yeah. Count on it. out of there.
No break? They're tracking us. I know that. I know that, but we aren't soldiers. We don't have your kind of stamina. You got enough to complain. Oh, that's... You... Forget it! I think... Hmm? Um... I'd stick with her if I were you. Later, then. <sighs> Come on. Let's get going. Get going to where, exactly? <sighs> the whole of Cocoon's against us. No matter how far we run, there's no escape. That Seath clock, it's still a ticket. There's still time. You give up too easy, old man. I'm not giving up. There are some things that you just can't change. A kid like you would not understand. Yeah, I'm a kid. I don't understand. Well, I guess we can be fugitives together. Mm -hmm. Oh. You ready? Ready! <laughs> Wait for me. I'm going with you. I can't babysit you anymore. I can fight. I'm not afraid. The twin sisters. <laughs> I gotta hand it to you for taking them down, but don't gloat just yet. Might come a time you wish you'd let him end it, and made things easy. Hmm. More of you, huh? He's a lessee. Take him. Back off. You want to keep breathing? Shut up and come quiet. Bring her this way! Careful now! Come on!
Sarah. Sarah! Shut it. Stand down. You two. Why are you helping them? If I were you, I'd worry about myself. This isn't working. Huh? I mean, you're a liability. You'll just slow me down. What? I'm sorry, but I can't protect you when... Uh, uh, you can't leave me here. You've got to take me with you. Enough! The whole world is against us. Uh, I can barely keep myself alive. Let alone some helpless kid! Uh, I don't have time to baby you. Lightning! Whoa. Your brand looks different. Was that an Eidolon? Like Lasekin summon? Magic and mumbo jumbo. I must have hit my head on that purge train. Um. Am I really in your way? I'll do better. I'll try harder. Oh. I'll... <sighs> we'll toughen you up. Huh? I'm sorry. About before. Shot. We gotta sleep somewhere. This look okay? Uh, yeah. Fine by me. Uh. <laughs> All set. Okay, good night. Not a care in the world. Understood? <sighs> Grow up. <laughs> and good night again. Did you just go to sleep already?
couldn't run if you wanted to. <laughs> Look at you! Wonder what's under the hood of that thing. Keep your pants on. You'll get a peek soon enough. Just try and behave. I'm not gonna make any promises. <laughs> Cheeky boy, aren't you? We'll see how long that lasts. He's come to meet you. Be Snow. Sid Rains, Brigadier General of the Fleet. Hi, Sid. Thanks for the escort. Uh, apologies. I just had a few questions to ask you. If it works like they tell us, that means she must have fulfilled her focus. Sarah! Fulfilled her focus. As a tainted pulse lassie, that is. You think she was out to hurt, Cocoon? I'd hardly be alone if I did. When it comes to Pulse, who could claim to know anything? I need the truth, for the sake of Cocoon. The sake of Cocoon? We're from Cocoon. Shipping us out, purging innocent people. That's how you lend us a hand? Those are the Sanctum's methods. The public fears what it doesn't do. It's grown tired of living in constant terror of these threats from the world below. So, the Sanctum devised a plan for you, Lassie. I'll bet. A public execution. <clears throat> the people don't know any better. Strike down the phantoms before their eyes, and they sleep like babes. No! <clears throat> the Sanctum has intelligence on the other Lassie already. It's only a matter of time. You'll never catch them. I see. We'll need your help then, won't we? I wonder how the others are doing. Saz and Vanille? Who knows? Even if they got away, they'll get caught eventually. Then they'll have to choose. Resist, or surrender. Surrender? Huh. Do you think he's still alive? You mean Snow? <sighs> He's too stubborn to die. And that's his best quality. He's arrogant and chummy from the get-go. He thinks he's everybody's pal. Never liked him much. He leads around a bunch of kids. Gang called Nora. Where'd they get the name Nora? It's a stupid acronym. Their little code stands for no obligations, rules, or authority. Must be nice. It's irresponsible. <sighs> we 
What's eating you? Okay, I can tell you're hung up on something. Is it the Lissy thing? It's snow, isn't it? What happened with him? You wouldn't understand. You and I are partners, Hope. My mother was killed because of him. his fault. And he needs to pay for it. I'm not ready yet, but I will be soon. That's why I followed you. Snow dragged us all into this. You and me, your sister, Sarah, he's got to pay. <sighs> ow! <sighs> I knew you were hard-headed, but... That was... Oh. Ow! Snap to it! We're rolling out! Yeah, yeah. Hunting the sea, right? I will keep my promise, Lightning. I thought you had somewhere in mind the way you took off. I followed the smell. What? Smells nice. All naturey. Huh. Just smells damp. And I think something bit me. Closest city that way is Palampolum. That is not good. I wonder if those two were caught in the net. What do we do? Mm -hmm. What do we do? I mean, right now, what can we do? Mm. Right. No choice. We run the other way. <sighs> Which would be to Nautilus. <laughs> oh. As we set off, it was like you'd forgotten that I was still there. What happened here? Bad luck. They came looking for us, and found something worse. We can't just leave them like this. Don't touch anything! <clears throat> Control your emotions. If you want to survive, 
You forget about sympathy. <sighs> How can I explain? Think of it like a strategy. Hmm. Focus on your ultimate goal and shut out everything else. Still your mind. Move on instinct. Let doubt take over, and despair will cripple you. <sighs> Strategy. Good. I'll take anything to help me get through this. I'll call it... Operation Nora. Nora? My mother's name. Your revenge? Yes. Don't tell me. I know getting revenge on him won't... bring her back. I know that! <laughs> but sorry won't cut it. Snow didn't kill your mother. The Sanctum did. Whose side are you on? The side of truth. Fine. I'll fight the Sanctum with you. I'll learn to survive. How can you judge someone else? When you know that you're the same, even I have dark secrets. Secrets I'd rather forget. We can board the ship over there. mess it's gotten us all into. Of course, it's not to say I always hate it. Seemed fishy. All that sanctum ranting about the threat from Pulse. Only a matter of time before they strike. Pulse is infested with monsters. Scare after scare. Even a shred of proof. Tired old cynics like me? Mm -mm. We don't just swallow that tabloid crap. No, no, not me. I figured the Sanctum was up to something crooked. At least until I got dragged in. Yeah. Now that I think about it, all this purge business. It really only happened because Dodge found that Pulse Foul C. You're wrong. Huh? Don't blame him. It was all... <sighs> yeah, you're right. There was that scum from Pulse behind it. I might as well have tried to stop the rain. I fought the tears, but they still fell. 
You're getting soaked. I'll be fine. It's only water. Look at us. Pulse the sea. Using a sanctum fallacy to tell where we're going. Sort of strange. Not really. We've relied on them our whole lives. The food we eat, the light, and water. It's all from the foul sea. You know, I think Cocoon was really built for them. The rest of us, we're just leeches. Parasites. You think? They protect us. Nurture us. They take care of, well, normal people. They treat us like we're special. Almost like... Like we're pets. Falsy world, raised on a Falsy leash. It was the only life I knew how to live. When it was taken from me, I was completely lost. Without a master to follow, my life had no purpose. Hope, listen to me. This Lassie curse, it took everything from me. My future, my dreams. I didn't want to think, so I fought instead. As long as I was fighting, nothing else was real. I was running away. And you, Hope, you got swept along with me. Lightning, I don't understand. Operation Nora is over. What? I... No! You told me to fight! I made a mistake! What? You can't do this. You can't just build something up like that. Then abandon me. I won't abandon you. I won't. So what do we do now? We're the sea. Taking time bombs. Enemies of Cocoon. If we can't follow the plan, do we just lay down and die? I didn't mean we should give up. Then what battles do we fight? And against who? Tell me that! I don't know yet. You don't know yet? That's right. I don't know yet. But I do know we can't lose hope. Hope? There is no hope. Not for Lassie. There's you. It's my name. Not who I am. I was just like you. Huh? My parents died. I had to be strong for Sarah, so I thought I needed to forget my past. And I became Lightning. I thought that by changing my name, I could change who I was. I was just a kid. Lightning. It flashes bright, then fades away. It can't protect. It only destroys. Sarah tried to tell me, but I wouldn't listen. There you are. If you really are, let's see. 
It's my job to deal with you. Typical. I threatened her. Come on, Slowpoke. <sighs> Sorry. Got held up. Where have you been? I'm really late, huh? The only one who believed her was Snow. Don't say it! Don't say his name. It brings everything back. I keep playing it in my head. What happened to her? And then I see his stupid face and... And he's smiling. How can he smile when she's dead? Uh, I know! There's nothing I can do about it. I hate knowing that. No matter what happens, she's not coming back. When I was fighting, there was, there was no time to think about it. It felt good just to give in. But now you... you start talking about hope. I'm sorry, I messed up. No. It's my fault. Attention all units. This is Director Roche, Psycom Division. The moon is caught in the grip of a pulse-born terror. If we allow the sea activity to continue, panic will rip our world apart. Peace and stability we have fought so hard to maintain will be nothing but a memory. Pulse the sea threaten our very way of life. They must be eliminated. There can be no hesitation. That is all. If we fail, our citizens. Talk to your dad. What? Why? Fighting without hope is no way to live. It's just a way to die. I want you to find the hope you were named for. Staying alive, I can help you with. But I can't... I can't give you hope. If you go to see your father, you think meeting my dad will... will make anything better? He's never listened to a word I've said. He's just... He'll never believe all this Lassie stuff. Snow believed Sarah, didn't he? Yeah. In a recently convened emergency conference, the Sanctum announced that the fugitive Lassie have been located. The military plans to apprehend the Lassie and carry out a public execution. These images coming to you live from the scene in Palom Polo. These are Lassie. Show no mercy. They aren't people. Their targets. Start running. What? I'll keep them busy. But you survive. That's 
some crowd. Gonna need a plan. <laughs> I... Since when have heroes ever needed plans? Him. Lightning, listen to me. Get moving. No, no, you don't understand. Sarah's all right. She'll turn back. Take care of Hope. Wait! And then there were three. <laughs> They're here! Hold it! Gotta go. <sighs> So how you been? Huh? Hang on! <laughs> Sea panic must still seem like a world away. Huh. Huh? Oh, hey. Looks like they're putting Eidolons on parade. Starting soon. What do you say? Let's go check it out. Sure! Huh? huh? We interrupt this program to bring you a breaking news update. The Lassie, who surfaced in Palampolum and attacked the city's citizens, are still on the run from authorities. Sanctum soldiers are tracking their location, but have yet to engage the fugitives. The presence of hostages has been confirmed. What's wrong? It's her! Yep. Looks like the army finally found him. Hostages? They should just blow them away with the Lassie. They're all infected by Pulse or something by now anyway. The parade's about to start. Come on, let's go. You've changed, haven't you? Seems like you've toughened up. I'm a Lassie. I had to. <laughs> Yeah, the only ones that ought to be fighting the army are us dumb grown-ups. You think it's stupid to fight? <laughs> it is if you get killed. <sighs> anyway, just lay low. Let the dummies duke it out. <laughs> the army's no match for Nora, right? He was... he was smiling. It's me. What's up? You damn well know what's up! 
Mm. Why haven't you called in? Sorry, slipped my mind. Ugh, right. What's your status? Great, great. Hope's great too. Are you all right? I'm great, you're great, everybody's great. Reunion time. What? Uh. Figure out a rendezvous point. Don't sweat it. That line's hyper-encrypted. Uh. Hey, sis. Is that you? I'm not your sister. This city's under our jurisdiction. We're the ones defending it. We should have a say in what's done to protect it. Attention all units. Ignore all fire zone restrictions. Fire at will. What? Whatever it takes to kill the Lassie. Over. Whatever it takes! You want to start a war in the streets? Civilians are still evacuating. The collateral we're talking about is unacceptable. You don't know what it's like out there! You don't understand why we're here. Who do you think it is, terrified of Pulse and begging us to kill him and see? It's not the Sanctum. It's not us. It's the people. We'll meet at Hope's place. Felix Heights, 35A. Right. See you there. Tell Fang hey. Hmm? Take care of Hope. All over it. <laughs> and I'll tell you more about Sarah when we meet up. I found out she can turn back. There's still hope. Snow, listen to me. It's about Hope. His My mother name. was... It's me. I decided... I Hope? Hope! Answer me! Hope! Yelling doesn't fix it. It's called interference. Uh, you can chit-chat when we get there. I've got point. You fall in behind. And see if you can't cool off that head of yours. Here. I'm not thirsty. Oh... Okay. Well, well, don't want to waste it. <sighs> Mommy? 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 Mommy. <sighs> Mommy. <sighs> I can't. Snow? <sighs> What do you plan to do? I need to know. I told you. Save Sarah, protect Cocoon, and have myself a big, happy family. Still, it's a long road ahead. Or maybe not so long. Whatever happens, things will work themselves out. Even if you're Lassie, you gotta keep fighting. Yeah. And what if that gets people around you involved? What? What happens when your actions end up ruining someone's life? What if someone dies? What then, Snow? How do you pay for what you've done? I can't! Right? There is nothing that can make something like that right again. When someone's dead, when someone's gone, Words are useless. So that's it? People die and you just run away? I know! It's all my fault. I don't know how to fix it. Where do you start? What do you say? All I can do is go forward. Keep fighting and surviving until I find the answers I need. There are no answers! You're running from what you deserve! Well, why don't you tell me what I deserve? The same fate! <laughs> Nora Estime. She was my mother. And she died because of you! You? You're the one she meant! Oh. 
Hey, Lightning. Call me Light. Did you see Vanille's brand? No. Mm, no, huh? Want to know how long until it's Seath City? Just look at your brand. <sighs> you start getting more arrows, and then finally an eye. Once it opens all the way, you're done. Let's have a look. Uh, oh. Don't be shy. Okay. Hmm. Nowhere near. You got time. Still, you never know. Some people doesn't take so long. You get a nasty shock, it can speed up the process. Vanille's brand must be pretty far along by now. I gotta save her and get her home. To Pulse, you mean? To Grand Pulse. I hear that the Sanctum prevents people from leaving Cocoon. I'd like to see him try and stop me. So, that's your plan. Hmm? Wish I had one. Without Sarah, without a future, there's nothing to plan for. There's no way out of this mess, and no way to fight it. I'm stuck trading blows with the Sanctum, but that's no plan. Even if we topple the government, where's that leave us? With nothing to fight for? I might as well be dead. Your sister. You've got plenty to fight for. Think about it. Don't you want to see Sarah after she wakes up? That's your future right there. All you got to do is survive. <laughs> it's simple. Right. No, they found him.
Hey. <clears throat> Why'd you save me? I was asked to keep you safe. By lightning. And by Nora. I'm sorry. What happened? It was my fault. I put her in danger. I know that. Let me make things right. You told me before that you couldn't. And that words were useless and a lot of other things I shouldn't have said. Look, I didn't know what to do. I didn't know how to set things straight. So I didn't. I thought if I couldn't make up for it, then all the apologies in the world wouldn't mean a thing. So I decided I had to find a way to pay for it first. Before I'd even have the right to say sorry. But, it's like you said, I was using that as an excuse so I could run from my own guilt. And that hit home. <clears throat> oh. Look, Hope. I know what happened was my fault. I don't deny it, and I am sorry. Here. That's lights, isn't it? I... Why'd you... That knife was a present from Sarah. To keep her safe. She trusted you with something that important. You should be the one to carry it. I'll find a way to make things better. Just give me time. If nothing I do is good enough, then I'll take any punishment you want to dish out. She's gone, Snow. You can take the blame, but... But it won't bring her back. I'm sorry. I knew it all along. I knew it, but... They had to blame someone. They had to. I needed a reason... To, to keep on fighting. It wasn't someone's fault. It was mine. Take it out on me. And keep yourself alive until you do. Hey, loosen up. Gotta make the most of this. <laughs> right? I knew we'd be saying goodbye soon. Better to do it with a smile. Um, Operation Nora didn't work out. Oh, oh my. You'll be okay. I'll keep you safe. Lightning. I... Me too. I mean, at least I'll try. I'll try to watch out for you too. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget about this one. <laughs> That one will be all right. He's too stubborn to die. <laughs> Knowing you'll always be welcome, no matter how much has changed. That's what having a home is all about. Nora. Dad, I, uh, I, I know. I, I'll be in my room.
We're gonna rest up. Then we'll leave. If they find out you're sheltering La Cie, they'll... Ah! You're my son! This is your home. Roughly 2,500 civilians believed to have come in contact with the Lassie are now being held in quarantine by the Sanctum. Our latest Instapol has shown a vast majority in favor of the immediate purging of these individuals, believing their treatment... Lay down. All right. See, you took the kid's toy away. Uh, he gave it back to me. Said he didn't need it anymore. <laughs> Go figure. It was too much. Hmm? What happened to Sarah? All I could think about was what could I have done? I hated myself for not trusting her. It hurt too much. I couldn't face it. Look, Snow. I... I'm sorry. Forgive me. For what? Everything. If you told me your real name, I suppose I could. <laughs> Have Sarah tell you. When she comes back. Deal. My dad said he'd like to see you guys. He wants to talk. <sighs> the blame is mine. I couldn't save her. <sighs> if it wasn't for Snow... I wouldn't be here right now. Snow... Did Nora... Did she say anything to you? Hope... She said to... To get him home. Hmm. <sighs> and that's exactly what you've done. Huh? Face to face like this, it's hard to believe you're all dangerous fugitives. But the entire world is scared to death of you, Lassie. No, not even just you. People who've helped you, bumped into you. Sometimes it's even just people who've walked by one of you. They think they're tainted and want every one of them purged. The Sanctum's a puppet of the foul sea. To them, our lives don't mean anything at all. Mm. We'll stop this. Take down the Sanctum and save Cocoon. You thought that through? <sighs> if Lassie take down the Sanctum, fear of Pulse will only get worse. It won't stop at fear. 
the people will take up arms and stand against you. Can you imagine it? The rampant violence. When the government's control is gone, the citizens will revolt. So what then? We're supposed to just smile and eat a bullet? That means you too. Huh. I know I'm part of this. I'm on your side of the fence. Harbor of the sea and a public enemy. Coming here was a bad idea. Hmm. This is your home. <laughs> We're all here. Let's figure this out together. Huh? Is it over? Are they... They're fine. Your son's a tough kid. the battalion. They'll take out the whole building next. Dad! Oh! Thank goodness. Are you hurt? No. How about you? Still in one piece. Some kind of monster? I'm flesh and blood like you, an ordinary citizen of Cocoon. Don't you get it? This has been our home our whole lives. How could we even think about destroying it? We want to protect this place just as much as you. Oh, he's on our side? Oh, he's lying. What is this talking? It's a trick. You must be Snow Villiers. Yag Roche, Psycom Division. I understand your plight. However, the Pulse threat is not so easily dismissed. The very existence of Ulysses puts every last one of us in danger. Tell me, do you really think your life is worth more than the lives of millions of Cocoon citizens? I do not. And so, it falls to me to order your execution. It's that simple. It is my responsibility to see you put down. Your lives are forfeit. Oh, cut the crap! You want Lassie? Then kill Lassie! Why do other people have to die? The purge has got to stop! Do you think we want to purge our own people? If any trace of Pulse remains, the populace will erupt into chaos! Without sacrifice, without the Purge, Cocoon will die! Oh. 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 
your dad. We threatened you and forced you to help us. Got it? There must be something Do else. Do what she says. I can't let you get dragged into this. I want to stay here, but there's no place for Alyssa. I'm going with the others. We'll survive somehow. I promise you that. Dad, I hate to run out on you. You're not running! This is not running away. You've made a choice. You'll survive and do what needs to be done. You mean... complete my focus? Don't you worry about that. You make the choice. <sighs> Thanks, Dad. Turn, hero. What? I can handle a little gas. Catch your breath. I'll throw in some hits for you. Don't get cute. Right, let's move it. to home and family, we never keep either as close as we should. Whoever stops to think that this time could be... The